Okay, so I've managed to hook my Atari ST up to the Creative T10 Inspire speakers. So here we go. For this one, load them from disk. Don't care what anyone says, the Atari ST can bounce out some amazing audio. You right, Chris? You right, Lee? Yeah, it's just uh, the way you can hear it all the top. Sorry, mate. Um, I was using those creative speakers for the Ion record player originally, but while I was setting this stuff up, I thought, oh, I wonder if I can hook them up to the um, ST. I just happened to find a lead that does the video and the audio, so I think that might be why it sounds a little bit pissy, but another one coming next week because I can put money there. there. Underneath that, as you have a look, you can see there's a good old Amiga 1200 and um, where the joystick is at the moment, I'm going to be setting up the Sega Saturn. Um, I've been setting everything up in here the last couple of days. Um, I've so I've got the big TV there, PS3, Steam Link, Dreamcast, N64, PS2 Slim, Mega Drive, GameCube and over there, Commodore 108 and BBC Model B, oh, both the disk drive and everything. Pretty cool. I 
I think the noise is just coming from the fact that I'm using one of those. It's the lead that it goes into a three and a half mil jack. Um, you know, like for a TV, like the modern Samsung. So the one I've got coming next week is just plug standard three and a half mil to the left and right audio, which should sound even better. Sounds good as the Omega version. It does sound as good as the Omega version coming out with those speakers rather than the TV. <laughs> yeah, and then so, oh, there's also all of them. Oh, as you can see, I'm still setting up the book. That's me, 70, there's 17 from up there. It's all the PS2 games there. I'm sure the CPC wish you haven't got set up yet. As you can see, still a work in progress, but all them games on the top is the Atari ST, Commodore 64, Amstrad CPC on the far left Amiga, behind the night box in the bag is all my Dreamcast stuff, lower shelves Amiga, then there, BBC Model B at the bottom, Master System at the top, um, and literally over there. There's all the Nintendo stuff, Sega Saturn stuff and whatever you absolutely... I've got mountains of stuff on it. So, so, but I have to give a shout out to Shelly though, she did get this done for us. Three and a half thousand pounds to get this upstairs done, which is really good event. You know, good stuff, really good stuff. I remember the PS4 there and all because um, she actually bought us a PS4 Pro and we got the 4K TV. Absolutely awesome of her. I'm actually sat in a bean bag at the old moment which she bought for us. It's a lot more comfortable than like sitting on a chair with having the systems on like upper and lower levels. At least it's easy to access them. Uh, remember shoot or die. Sorry, Ken. Complete large plane. I'll jump up and I'll show you around the rest of it. So, yes, um, some bought us the uh, Jack Skellington. Your mini from your wife, that's all the thing. Yep. Um, got this thing about Monsters Inc, by the way. I really do have this thing about Monsters Inc. My wife bought us a brilliant clock and a floor mat as well to put down once I get sorted. Uh, Majority Kings CD DAB Plus just got in that radio and everything. Red Dwarf Arnold Rimmer film cells. CDs. A few other games there. I can see quite a lot on the Nintendo somewhere have you. 64 and I'll have to lean out over here. It's a bit sketchy this. But um oh I'll come round more Mega Drive stuff down there, and as you can see, you've got singles and LPs and what have you down there. It's kind of hard to see. <laughs> so yeah, it's uh, metal. Put it in there. In there. Oh, bring it up with the camera. Maybe under the uh, tune here. Right. Beanbag. Yeah, as you can see there, uh, all the ST stuff. That's me there. Uh, Dark Souls 3 limited edition review crate, which I was sent from Bandai Namco. Did the review for uh, Dom Over DVD Fever. Limited edition Witcher 2 for the PC. Tony Amstrad. All the Mega Drive stuff. Lights are too clever here. Oh, that's 64 stuff. 64 is the original stuff. That's the um, SD to IEC for the 64. Oh, yeah, it's a uh, canny life. Canny. Oh, yeah, and uh, PC games. And other things and Dread Books. So, yeah. 
Right, I'm gonna sign off now because basically that tune's now running background. Please all over. Thank you.